Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm going to go through the quiz answer that I posted on LinkedIn on target costing and learning curves. So here's the quiz question. Using target costing principles, a product's labour cost is estimated using an 80% learning rate. It is later revised to be 85%. What's the correct answer? A. The target cost increases. B. The cost gap increases. C. The target price increases. Now, in order to answer this question, you need to know two concepts, target costing and learning curves. And this question combines the two. So let's start with target costing principles. Firstly, the market sets the price. The target cost is then calculated from the required profit margin off that market price. Your estimated cost to produce that product or service is then compared to that target cost and a cost gap is then calculated. It's this cost gap which is closed through value engineering. And that means looking at the product or service and seeing what the customer may not value in that market price. Or looking at the product or service and re-engineering things out of it, i.e. putting things in that are slightly cheaper for the same quality. With that in mind, therefore, target cost remains constant as this is based on the market price and your desired margin. It's not impacted by our estimated costs. So we then move on to mind the gap. It's the cost gap that exists if the estimated costs are higher than the target. So looking at learning curves, the lower the learning rate percentage, the quicker the workforce will learn, remember. Changing the learning rate from 80% to 85% is therefore slower. So units are produced more slowly. More slowly means more cost. So this will increase labour costs and therefore widen that gap. So therefore your answer is the cost gap increases. Hope you all got that right. It's not the target cost increases or the target price increases. They are fixed. The price is set by the market. You have a profit margin, which then sets that target cost based on that price. So the answer is the cost gap increases. That's the difference between the estimated cost and the target cost. And if the labor time increases, therefore the estimated cost increases. So good luck PM sitters. That's one MCQ cracked.